Mike Forward for Peace FM and Chet TV. And in with me once again is Naomi from the Chetwin Chamber of Commerce. And Naomi, uh, we're into October now. So what's going to be happening in the Peace region here in October? Oh, gosh, there's actually so much going on. Um, first, I would really like to thank everybody who came out to support Harvest Fest uh, September 14th. It was our biggest event uh I think just about ever since I've had it, uh, since 2017. Uh, we really like to thank all of our sponsors for making that happen. Uh, it was it was phenomenal. It was a fantastic day. I immediately left on holidays the next day, so um, it was it was well worth it and so much fun. So October is our membership renewal month. Um, we have um, currently just over 165 members at the Chetwin Chamber of Commerce. So we are going to be starting our membership, uh, new new member sign up and our, our yearly renewal. Uh, we had a prize for the first business to renew this year, and that prize actually went to Rat Race Contracting. They were the first business, uh, first member to renew their membership for the 24-25 uh, season or for the year. And we actually uh, gave them a little present. They got a $50 gift certificate from another chamber member from Crazy Peens Bistro. So nice. thanks to Rat Race for being the first ones to renew. Uh, keep an eye out to our members for your renewal invoice uh, in your email. Uh, if you are not a member of the Chamber of Commerce, you can get a hold of us uh, at www.chetwinchamber.ca and you can download our membership form there. Uh, currently, it is last year's membership form that is up on the site, but that is because we're in the middle of a rebranding. Uh, and a brand new website is being constructed. So ignore the 2023-24, it's 24-25, prices haven't changed. And hopefully we'll be uh, releasing and announcing our rebranding and new website here in the next couple months, hopefully by the new year. So that's pretty exciting. Um, so we have a couple of new members as well that have joined up with the Chamber of Commerce this, this, uh, this month. Uh, we have one member, uh, CTI Plus Resources. Um, some folks may have heard about them uh, a little bit around town. They are a new uh, coal exploration company that's going to be opening up uh, just outside of Chetwind. They're based out of Calgary, uh, and they're working on the Rocky Creek Metallurgical Coal Project, uh, located 47 kilometers south of Chetwind within the Peace River Regional District. They're actually hosting an open house here in Chetwind on October 16th that uh, we've uh, advertised for them as well. So up at the Tamarack Hall, and I believe it's at 6.30. So if you're looking for some information to get to know this new company that's coming to town, um, definitely pop in. The Little Prairie Community Forest has joined as a member. They are a cooperative venture between the District of Chetwin, Soto First Nation and West Moberly First Nations. And we just signed up the Farmers Information Service. Uh, this uh, group is available to help farmers, ranchers, and landowners in the Peace River Regional District navigate interactions with oil and gas companies. Uh, the Farmers Information Service has been a regular staple at the Chetwin Train Show each year as well, so they've joined up as a member. Um, I'm not sure if people have seen, they've probably seen now, um, the Chetwind Chamber and the Tumbler Ridge Chambers of Commerce. Uh, we have decided to not host an all-candidates forum uh, this round for the provincial election. The issue is being is that we kind of want to be the Chetwin Chamber of Commerce and Ch the Chambers of Commerce are nonpartisan. So in the lead up to the election, um, all while all the candidates were invited to participate in the forums, only one accepted the invite. So we couldn't actually host an all candidates debate with only one candidate. Um, so we are asking uh, residents to reach out to the candidates personally, to touch base with them, ask your questions, get as much information as you need from them, um, and then don't forget to uh, register to vote in the provincial election and, and make sure you get down to, to vote. It's only in a couple weeks. It's only in a couple weeks. Um, the, oh, the last time we spoke, we were talking about the Business Excellence Awards coming up and that we needed nominations. And we are getting nominations, which is wonderful. They're starting to trickle in. Excellent. We've extended the deadline till October 15th. Um, and while we're getting uh, some great nominations, we're also reminding people that we are also taking nominations for Citizen of the Year, Junior Citizen of the Year, and Volunteer of the Year, as well as our businesses. Uh, if you look on the back page of the Chetwin Coffee Talk this week, there is a nomination form right on the back page that you can just fill out and, uh, and send right to us. 
You can email it to manager at chetwindchamber.ca. You can drop it off at our office. Uh, we're located downtown in the old doctor's office, 5121 47th Avenue. Or you can go right to our website as well, and you can uh, fill out the nomination form right on our website. It comes right to us. So our event for this year for Business Excellence Awards is going to be November 15th at the Royal Canadian Legion. We're really hoping to have a wonderful evening uh, recognizing these amazing people in our community. Uh, we're hoping to have dinner, dancing, some entertainment, and hand out the awards. So keep your eyes open because planning is going to be going <laughs> very quickly. Um, we had um, our Mind Your Business September luncheon with the Chetwin Rotary Club uh, in in September last month because it's October already. Holy smokes. Um, one of the things they had touched on, and actually I'm heading there right after this, is uh, the Rotary Club is going to be taking on the downtown Christmas uh, light up. Uh, we're, so we're going to be working with the Chetwin Rotary Club to help bring on that uh, new celebration this year. So more information will be coming um, in the near future with that. What else have we got? Uh, the Chetwin Chamber of Commerce AGM is coming up in November and we are looking for directors. If you're interested in being a director with the Chetwin Chamber of Commerce, you can get a hold of us and I will send you a uh, director's nomination package. Uh, we meet every second month on a date that's decided by the board each year. Uh, it's not a huge amount of time, um, but we always joke that if you want to get something done, ask a busy person. So all those busy people out there, if you want to get involved with a really fun uh, group that we are super supportive and involved in our community, and we want to see everybody succeed, get a hold of us. And I think... I think that is it right now. I will touch quickly as well on an organization called the South Peace Mackenzie Trust. The South Peace Mackenzie Trust is an organization that has um, currently $10 million of literally free money, free money to, to hand out to uh, entrepreneurs and businesses to help create jobs, diversify the economy, and alleviate potential impacts in the peace region within 100 kilometers of the communities of Mackenzie, Chetwin, and Tumbler Ridge. And this is surrounding the uh, caribou recovery and habitat restoration impacts. In most cases, the maximum grant that will be considered for any one project will be $250,000. However, if an applicant can demonstrate a high probability of creating a large number of new income earning positions and or creating some other exceptional benefit to the South Peace Mackenzie area, that is consistent with the recovery of the southern mountain caribou herds, a larger grant can be considered. So uh, anybody can apply uh, as long as it facilitates the creation of incremental income earning positions. So uh, if you are interested, you can log on to www.spmtrust.ca and you can get more information there. Uh, we've had a couple of, we've had quite a few people apply to this organization and been successful so if you're looking for information definitely get a hold of me and i can point you in the right direction excellent and uh in terms of getting a hold of you for the chamber how do people do that once you again? can phone or text me at 250-788-3345 or you can drop me an email at manager at chetwindchamber.ca and do you guys have a social media presence we do we have our facebook page as well as our instagram page excellent and uh yeah, we'll be talking again next month. Absolutely. Thanks right. so much. Thank you so much.